everyone welcome back to another exo zeros video so in today's video we're going to tackle the question of is fc scarlet um worth pulling for so i've been getting a lot of um questions in youtube as well as discord and as well as in facebook um is she really worth pulling for so let's go go down to you know um what she actually gives um your team so so the buffs that she has right here um grants combat power a certain percentage um it's now for me plus 5.7 percent but for the attack percentage it's plus 6.25 percent don't be fooled by the percentage i already have her fusion two times so that is why it's that high but the basic would be at two two for attack percentage so more or less why do you want to pull for her because she gives attack percentage to attack type heroes so let's break down the attack type heroes that are viable for her buff for each nation so let's move to our heroes let's try to sort this out by sorting by uh what do you call this attack where is it here and sorting it by nation let's start with pedas so for pedas um if you if you are building pedas it's only lang that's an attack type character or attack type hero so again um if you're you know if you're building pe uh, pedas i don't think she would be worth for you next would be Let's take a look at Saint West. So if you already have um, FC Nemeris like I do and Carry, both of them are attack type as well. So again, if you're building um, Saint West, um, she can be used. She can be a good option. But again, Carry needs her Fate Core um, to you know to be released for it to be worth your while. Next would be for. Historic Republic. So let's go to Historic Republic. And to my surprise, these are the only heroes that are viable or are attack type heroes. So the ones that the one that's viable here would only be FC Adams. Um, I don't know about Fernando. He hasn't been used quite yet. But again, um, only one for Historic Republic if you want to summon for um fc scarlet next would be on our list would be vagabond obviously for vagabond we're actually mostly using fc schmid so if you can see it's only fc schmid here so if you are carrying fc schmid plus other attack type heroes i think it would be worth you pulling for fc scarlet next would be Greenland so as far as Greenland is concerned so these are your attack type heroes again um, the one um, notable there is Bathory the rest are I'm not sure yet if you should you know pull if you're concentrating on 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 Greenland alone um, I don't think he's worth it again you mix you should mix Bathory with other attack type heroes so Bathory is an attack type hero. Next would be North Von Frosty. For North Von Frosty, again, um, there are a lot. Actually, there are quite a selection. You have here Astarte with her um, silver fate core. You have Bernadette, her black fate core, but she's not really being used right now in the meta. But you have here Brooke, which is actually decent in PvP. So more or less, they have somehow of a good selection of attack type characters, but or heroes, but none of them are being used in the the North Vost, uh, North Von Frosty team that is actually being used in PvP. So again, um, you could probably consider pulling for FC Scarlet uh, if you if you have North Von Frosty, but again, you should be using FC Brook with her. Okay, next would be Lenombe. 
I think the two remaining nations that I will be presenting will be more viable for, for FC Scarlet. So let's take a look at Lenombe. Um, again, the top three here are being used in the meta. So you have Rachel, Zion, Morris, um, all used in the PvP meta, especially for Lenombe. Then our last would be Wasted Red. So for Wasted Red, Wasted Red, again, you have quite a few that are being used in PvP. So you have Rudley, Annie, Maggie, um, and a bunch of others that are not being used. So just to summarize actually what my point of this video is, take a look first at the nation that you are using, whether they have a decent number of attack heroes that can benefit from FC Scarlet, then probably mix and match them with uh, with with the other nations which have attack type heroes. So let's say for example, let's take for example, if you want to build a team that's based solely on you pulling for FC Scarlet and you want that team to be composed of attack type heroes, my suggestion is let's say for example, if you're already bringing Wasted Red, so one two three, take out. You take out uh, Iris, take out Ramji, you put in Garf, change your formation, change your formation, then you put in, who's the other one? Maggie. So this is actually a good formation for, for attack percentage in terms of giving them benefit because all four at the back are actually attack type heroes. Let's have another mix of heroes so let's go the Lenombe route so you have there um okay you have one uh rachel you have there morris and you have there there you go so probably your front row would be April. So where is she? See April. Okay. So again, another example for Inombe because you, you wanted to combine um, heroes uh, from other factions. So for Inombe, I think this would be the ultimate one in terms of um, benefiting from FC FC Sabrina's um, buff for for percentage of attack. Another will try to build another one. So let's filter again. Attack type. Then confirm. Okay, so these are your attack type uh, heroes already. So more or less, if you want to go the route of of uh, what they call this of uh historic republic you'd go with schmidt um adams then take up the stick up the filter so so uh yeah sorry so let's put in janai you have two attack heroes already here you have Shell. The other one, I think, would be... Let's take a look. So... I'm not sure if this is going to work. But more or less, you could actually bring Annie here if you want. That could work. Or you could bring in Redley, which is... He's also an attack type hero so more or less again guys um let's go back to the question is fc scarlet worth it i think yes depending on which heroes you're 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 using depending on which nation you're using and number three depending on the mix of heroes that you're using especially for pvp so again um more or less, that's it for me. Um, I hope that answers your question. For those who have asked me that, I hope you actually take a look at, at this video. And 
again, I was actually surprised that there there are quite a few attack type heroes um, outside of Wasted Red and Inombe. So more or less, Wasted Red and Inombe will really benefit from FC Scarlet. Um, oh, sorry, FC Sabrina. So more or less, that's it. Anyway, guys, um, for those of you who haven't subscribed yet, around 85% of my view uh, of my viewers have not subscribed yet so please do this helps a lot my channel um also please do comment down below in the comment section what do you think of this video do you think i'm correct in terms of my assessment and if not also please write it down below anyway guys stay safe take care this is the warden and i'm out of here